There is a person here, you have a moving object in your body. Whenever there's a promise for something, this moving object moves in your body. Come, let us pray with you so that God can help you. The person I was talking about is this sister of the purple jacket. And this object always moves when there's a promise you've received. Yes. And you know, once it moves, it means you're going to get in use of disappointment. Yes. Today, I stop this moving object. In Jesus' name, come out of her body. Out in the name of Jesus. Out. In Jesus' name. My sister, you are free. You won't have this moving object anymore. I greet you all in the wonderful name of our Lord Jesus Christ. The viewers all over the world, welcome to Charis Missionary Church. This is our Wednesday live service under the leadership of Apostle JP and Prophetess T.E. Maganessa. And with me here today is my sister who was located during the service by Prophetess Tendo Simono who ministered upon her life, ma'am. Kindly please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. My name is Mila Nimalulege from Timbisa. Today during the service, the woman of God located you and she ministered upon your life. I'd love that you kindly please tell us what she said and please confirm it. Oh, she located Jesus. me during the service. She said there's a lady, there's a, there's a person among our, among our midst who's having a moving object in the body. And I confirmed the prophecy to be true because like I was having a moving object, sometimes it will from my legs, sometimes it will go in my chest to my throat, sometimes in my waist, sometimes... Uh, yeah, I had the moving object, but now I believe that it is gone. Yeah. And she further elaborated, um, kindly please tell us in details what she said after you came to the front. Oh she, she, oh, she said that this moving object normally comes when there's a promise. When, I, when, when there's a promise, yeah, this object will, will be like, will be very much, like it will move like very much more, more especially in my left leg. It will move like to my stomach and my, like, my chest, to my throat. Yeah. And how did that affect you? It has affected me a lot because it's like people will promise me something and disappoint me, and promise and disappointment. And after promising me, I will face disappointment. Mm. And how do you feel that today, Prophet Estanda located you, ministered upon your life, and even delivered you? I feel I feel very good that I feel very light, and I believe that this moving object is gone for uh, forever. Amen. There's a spirit that is following you that comes from home, that is stealing from you. Hmm? Amen. You are that person that things disappears. Yes. Even money disappears. Yes. It's a spirit that is stealing from you. Whatever you hold with your hand, yeah. in Jesus' name. Ouch! In Jesus' name. Mama, you are free. You, this moving object, what, what I was explaining to mommy is what happens to you. But with you, it also happens in your workplace. Yes. Whenever there is something serious that you have to do that is going to bring breakthrough, you lose your documents. Yes, it's true. All the time. All the time. This is a spirit that is stealing from you. Today I stop this moving object. In Jesus' name. They will, they will call you. There's something that you were working on which was very serious. Yes. Intensely so. It included a lot of things. Yes. And all of a sudden your documents went missing. Expect a call. We are going to start that thing again. Today during the service, Prophetess TJ Simona located him and ministered upon his life. Sir, kindly please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. My, my name is Godfrey Mawai. I'm from... 
Today during the service, Prophetess Tenda located you and she ministered upon your life. Please tell us what she said and please confirm it. Yeah, what what she prophesied about me is true because every time I receive a breakthrough with regard to work, everything just collapsed and uh, I didn't know what is what is the cause. Because uh, at the beginning of the month, I was appointed to be a, a shadow mediator. Then all of a sudden, when we went to the discussion of Zoom, then I was outlined. But uh, they've been calling some people, the and then they said, "No, uh, we will we'll get the second hand information." Man. And every time when something wants to come seriously, things they just fall apart. Yes. Prophetess Tendo Simona also mentioned um, a moving object in your body. Kindly please confirm. Yes, yeah, true. The, there's a moving object which I, I, I don't understand. Normally, it's like something is just uh, moving, making a noise in my stomach. And I didn't know, I just started all of a sudden. Then at first I used to think that perhaps it might be high blood, but when I went to hospital, they said there is no such, but I realized that it's an attack. Yes. And so how do you feel that today Prophet Estendo Simon allocated you and she ministered upon your life? Then, um, I'm very happy because now the problem has been identified because it was, it was troubling me all along. And I didn't know exactly what, what is the cause because these things uh, just, just came all of a sudden. Then uh, I've been trying to do everything, even exercising, thinking that it's going to go, but it was not going. Yes, it was, it was even making sound, even in my noise, that something will just was uh, making sound, sound, sound. Jesus and I didn't understand. Even my wife just complained that sometimes you don't even hear me properly. And even on my bed, that things continuously doing that. But today I'm here because it has been identified. I, my sister, let me pray. I will come to you. Let me pray with you. You. Come. Let me pray with you. I want to pray with you so that we can tell operation yes. on you. Because you feel tightness and you have uncomfortable pains. Yeah. And now it's like this blessing is now becoming a curse because it's heavy and painful. Yes. And now it has also started affecting your legs. There are times that your legs become numb. Place your hands on your, tum on your stomach. In Jesus' name. Your evil spirit. Out! Out! The name of Jesus. Out! The name of Jesus. I cancel this operation in Jesus' mighty name. My sister, you are free. <laughs> Test your legs. You will hear that you are free. You are free. From today, you will sleep. You won't feel pains anymore. Until your time comes, you will deliver this baby nicely and naturally. No more operation in Jesus' name. Kindly you please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. My name is Marugwa Shipriwa. I am from Tuandu, Venda. Today during the service, Prophet Estendo Sumana located you and she managed that upon your life. Kindly please tell us what she said to you and please confirm it. She said that she's in the operation through my pregnancy. So the things that she said is true. I know it was happening, but now I feel relieved and I thank God for everything. The God of Charis Mishnari Church. Yeah, thank you. Ma, please tell us a background story of what's been happening. You just confirmed that you do know what the prophetess is talking about. Please tell us more. What I can say right now is that this pregnancy has been hard for me since from the start. I have been not enjoying these pregnancies. 
since it started until today. But today, now, as I'm speaking right now, I feel relieved. And I, I, feel, I feel everything is fine in my port. And what's, what are some of the difficulties that you would face or that you are facing during this pregnancy? Since this pregnancy started, I can't sleep. I can't work properly. Everything that I do, I feel tired every time. But now I'm relieved. And Ma, how do you feel that today prophetess located you, ministered upon your life, prayed for you, and even declared that you're going to give birth naturally? Yeah, what the, the, the prophetess has said, I believe and I know that what he, she has said is going to be like that, exactly what she has said. And I thank God for the God of charity. I saw trouble at home. Manito. Yeah, it's true. I wish you can stop doing things at home because that's where everybody is monitoring you. Amen. Because right now, since the last time you went home, sleeping has become a problem. Yes, yeah, true. I'm having pains at my back. You're having pains at your back? Yes. Stop doing things at home. I'm also seeing a house at home. Yes. Hmm? Yes, sister. Stop doing things at home. Amen. That's where your enemies are. Yes. And your enemies are closer than you think. Yeah, that's true. Okay? Yes. Place your hand on your chest. In Jesus' name. Jesus' name. Jesus' name. Jesus' name. He has to vomit this thing. Out! Out! Did, Ceci, did your husband tell you that he has a problem on his chest? He told you. Did you guys go to the doctor? He hasn't gone to the doctor. He I hasn't. I have something here on my chest. Touch your chest. Out! Come out! In Jesus' name! He has to vomit this thing or else he won't be free. Ceci, come. Ceci, hi. Stop eating other people's food. Peasant mustn't just cook for you and say, I have cooked this and this, and I came with, and you eat. You hear? In Jesus' name. Wife, sir, kindly please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. Hi, my name is Charles Chibambo. I come from Pretoria, but originally from Guyane. Yes. Um, Today during the service, Prophet has located you and ministered upon your life. Please tell us what she said and please confirm it. Mm, I'm very happy for being located today by the woman of God. I want to confirm what she said and or prophesied me. Because the last time I went home I was okay, but when I came back I started to be sick. And I saw even the actions from the people from home then that people there are not happy with what I'm doing. And I want to confirm also the issue of the house. I was still doing some finalization, painting, and some plumbing. But I think some people are not happy. When I came back, I started to be sick. My back was so painful. But since I started to come to church, everything 
became better and I'm happy for that. Amen. And so how do you feel that Prophet has located you and ministered upon your life and even delivered you? There is a person here who's about to lose their job. Please come, we pray together. There is a person here who's about to lose their job. Please come, we pray together. At work, things are already not nice. And they have told you that they are releasing people. And you are one of those. Short-temperedness. You are very short-tempered. Yes, man of God. Hmm? Yes, man of God. And now your short-temperedness is costing you your job. Because there are people who say they think you think you are better than them. Yes. So they want to show you that you are not. Yes, oh God. Place your hand on your chest. Where is your mother? My mother is in Zimbabwe. When I said place your hand on your chest, I saw your mother crying. If you lose your job, your mother will be very much heartbroken. Because you are a hope. <laughs> Please raise him up. I'm blocking him. He's a millionaire, you are yes, blocking him. Yes. Why are you not speaking in tongues a few seconds ago? The spirit. Yeah? The spirit that is making confusion. The spirit that is He's a man of God. He's a powerful prophet, this one. So what are you Very doing? Anointed. To him? What are you doing to him? I just want him to be confused, having a lot of women. Last hmm? time he's got a situation. He's supposed to be dead. He's supposed to be dead. Now he's supposed leave him. to be dead. I you, say in the woman. You ancestral spirit, leave this young man. In the name of Jesus. Come out. Come out. Come out. Out. Leave this young man. Leave this young man. I said leave him. Again what? In Jesus' name. You are defeated. You are free. Nice, sir. Kindly please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. My name is Donald. I come from Tishlot. Today during the service, Prophet Estendo Jesus. located you and he, she ministered upon your life. I'd love that you kindly please tell Jesus. us in details what she said and please confirm it. Yeah, she said, uh, Prophet said that I've got short tempered that allow me I to lose my job because they say that I know, I know a lot, which is true. And uh, she prayed for me, and I believe that God has delivered me from this spirit. Amen. And maybe if you can provide us with examples of things that you do I when you were short-tempered. Yeah, I, uh, I work. I, I work with med uh, medicine. I'm a pharmacist, so normally sometimes when you give patients, so sometimes I uh, I always um, tell my colleagues how to to I mean to use uh, how to explain to people. So maybe they get frustrated by that. So that's why the the spirit I don't know what this maybe is working against me to for me so that I want my my like I want uh, I won't be able to help them. Mm. And how do you feel that today, Prophet has located you and ministered upon your life? I feel so happy, and I know that my life will never be the same. And I'm happy that uh, God has placed a gift in my life, and everything will manifest for the glory of God. Can I talk to you? Your spirit is very down. And your spirit is broken. And now you want to give up. Mm, mama. Now you want to give up. Huh? 
Mama, talk to me. I'm hearing God say, don't give up. Remember, you've come a long way. Yes. Hmm? Yes. Remember what happens in the family. Separation. Don't give up. Are you hearing me? This is a spirit from the other family. Hmm? That actually wants a divorce here. <laughs> Your spirit. Come out of mama. Come out. Out. What are you doing? Eh? No, 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 no. She no, must no. Go. She must go. She must divorce. She must do what? She must divorce. She must divorce. No, no, no. Why do you want her to divorce? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah? We need this man. Everything is yours. I know. She, she must leave him. She must leave him. She must leave him. She must now you spirit of the family, I command you to leave her. I, Out! In the name of Jesus. Take your things and come out. Out! In Jesus' name. There will be no divorce in Jesus' mighty Rezma, name. Can you please tell us your name and tell us where you come from? My name is Konima Tebula from Midrand. Today during the service, Prophetess Tendo located you and she ministered upon your life. I'd love that you kindly please tell us what she said to you and please confirm it. Uh, the woman of God said, um, my spirit is down. And she says, she also said that I'm tired. Yes, that was true. But even if I, do, I was not aware that I'm tired. But what she said is true. I confirm to be true because there's so many things that is happening in my family, in my marriage. That is making me tired. But Can you maybe give us practical examples of what's happening? Uh, I find that my husband is doing so many things that I, I can't tolerate anymore. Yeah. And how has that affected your marriage? Mm, by the grace of God, I, I, I thought I was coping. Yeah. And how do you feel that today Prophet has located you and she ministered upon your life? I thank God very much that he, uh, he located me today. I know I'm free today. I'm free. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Mr. With, with a yellow, yes, you, come with your wife. I'm going to pray for one more person and I leave, right? Finances. Sorry, finances. I'm seeing that you've been wanting to get out of this place for a long time now. And now God is going to bring finances so that you can leave this place. You go to a better one. Amen. Okay? And these finances are going to come through a promotion that's going to come. Are you hearing me say? Yes, I'm hearing you. What did I say? The finances will come through the promotion. Through a promotion. Very soon you are going to be promoted and you are going to get a better salary than this one. Amen. Which will enable you to get out of here. Amen. In Jesus' name. Sir, sir, kindly please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. My name is uh, Mr. and Mrs. Ndala. We are coming from Johannesburg. Today during the service, Prophet has located you and ministered upon your lives. Kindly please tell us what she said and please confirm it. Uh, Prophet Tendo uh, located us and said, uh, finances, is it uh, challenges in finances? Uh, he said, we have a property that we are at at the moment, but we wanted to move for a long time. He see, she sees us moving, but for us to move, we need more finances, and that finances will come through the promotion at work. That promotion, it, when it comes at work, it will come with an increase, which will enable us to move out. 
And so how long have you been trusting in God for a promotion? It's been a while now, trusting for God for promotion, as well as moving out from our current house. We thank God for uh, locating us at this particular time. And Ma, how do you feel that today Prophet has located your family and she ministered upon your lives? I feel very happy because we've been wanting to move to our new property. And for the promotion, we've been expecting this promotion from 2020. So I'm glad that today is our day. God's time is the best. Shunga, I pray against this name of yours. Come. Pray against this name. Of yours. Okay. Okay? Yes. Because now this name, the devil is using it against you. Okay. Are you hearing me? Yes, I am. What did I say? I should pray against my name. Because what? Because the devil is using it. The devil me. is using it, using your name, yes. Shiungasi, yes. against you. Okay. Ne? okay. My sister, I want to pray with you. Just like that woman, you are tired. You feel like giving up. Yes. Ani? Yes. And now your your heart is broken. Yes. Because instead of things going up, they went down. True. Hmm? Yes. And now you are in a place or working in a place where you're not supposed to be working. Yes. Instead of a promotion, you got demoted. Yes. So I want to pray with you so that you go, you get a promotion that is better than the position you were having. Amen. And Eric, when they demoted you, there was a promise. Yes. Remember? Yes. Of a promotion. Yes. Now, instead of the promotion, you got a demoted. You got demoted. Yes. Now, I want to pray with you so that God can take you back to that, to that promise. Amen. In Jesus' name. Did your wife tell you that she sees a big animal that comes at night? Mm, not what I know of. Normally she just tells me that she dreams of snakes. Come, I pray for you. Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. My sister, you are free. Let us clap our hands for the Lord. Yes, sir, kindly please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. Uh, I'm Shunga. See, um, I, 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 I'm based on Midrand. Uh, my name is Shungasi, and next to me is my lovely wife. Uh, we are based in Midren. Yes. Today, during the service, Prophetess Tender located you and ministered upon your lives. Please tell us what she said and please confirm it. The woman of God located me concerning my name, Shungasi, that I must pray against it cause, because uh, the devil is using it against me. That's what she said. Um, can you please tell us what your name means? Shungas uh, simply means uh, something that takes away boredom or entertainment or something to play with. So, hence I was told that I must pray against this name, uh, meaning the devil is using it against me, that meaning so that my life will have no direction. It, it, like it will be meaningless. Yes. And are you aware of what the prophetess is talking about? Have you been experiencing any setbacks or...? Yes, uh, I, I know, I know. I can attest to that. Uh, there are many things that I've tried, but uh, there was no luck. So, yes, uh, it does work against me. Yes. And prophetess Tender also spoke to you. Um, your wife, <laughs> Prophet Estender, also yeah, spoke to you. Us. Kindly please tell us what she said to you. Okay, thank you. Uh, Prophet Estender spoke about my workplace, mm -hmm. that where I'm working, I'm not uh, 
what I'm doing is not what I'm supposed to be doing and I can confirm it to be true. Yes. And how has that affected you? Uh, I'm always complaining to my husband about uh, my workplace. Yeah, so I'm not happy at all. And how do you feel that today the woman of God located you and ministered upon your life? I'm feeling happy and blessed. Yes. And so how do you feel that today the women of God located your family? It's a blessing to be located by God using a his servant. Uh, we were not expecting to be located, but God knows what we are going through. Then he located us and then uh, he, he, he opened our eyes so that we know what we must pray for and how to conduct ourselves from now on.